since Baluz is so kind to feature me on her YouTube, um, and I'm five days out from my first fall if you meet in the sub 93 kilogram division. Uh, usually I compete at the 105 kilograms. Um, uh, I'll document some stuff throughout the week, uh, like my training, my my food, my yeah, everything that that belongs uh, to a peak week in, um, in powerlifting. And so I'm gonna document like what I have on a normal day, since I'm in a deficit for about eight months now, coming from. 3,500 calories a day uh, to now unfortunately 2,500 calories a day uh, when I'm training and even less like 2,000 a day when I'm rest uh, when I have a rest day uh, or do mobility active rest day something like this um, I'm pretty much uh, tight on a tight budget um, as you can see um, I got two protein shakes, one for the afternoon and one for for yeah for post workout because it's bro. <laughs> then I got my BCAAs since I'm uh, on intermittent fasting and want to make it throughout the the uh, yeah till noon till until I break my fast. Uh, got some creatine. Uh, then as afternoons uh, as a, as fast breakers some was some very unappealing bro food uh, brown rice veggies and uh, turkey and as afternoon snacks uh, an apple banana and some toast and as pre workout some um, discounted version of pickup um, yeah. That's it so far. I'll document some stuff more. Shut up. So this is the gym where I deadlift. Um, I can't deadlift in conver commercial gyms anymore because all the gyms in my city don't allow me to because the weights bang so loud and uh, this is uh, this is a library and not a gym I don't know uh, but this is um, a weight lifting association and uh, you can do whatever the, what the uh, hell you want there um, they're they're pretty cool they're they're all more old schoolish uh, weightlifters but they tolerate the uh, powerlifting as well and some of them also did powerlifting or used to do powerlifting when they were younger um, as you can see <laughs> I um, have to figure out how to place the camera as I cut off my head uh, on the deadlifts uh, here um, I started deadlifting sumo to about one and a half years ago um, but uh, if you follow me on Instagram you know do know it's my least favorite lift because my form collapses every yeah three to four months and uh, I have to readjust it but for now this has, has to do it and it's okay it's not great but it's all right I started with uh, 90 kilograms for th three reps uh, followed by 117 kilograms for three and the final warm-up set was 135 for three uh, I really like warming up with the lower weights or low, lower reps um, and increasing the, the weight fast um, because yeah the faster you get to the working set the um, the better it feels in my opinion um, and since on the taper you just do have the volume uh, that you usually do um, yeah this this felt pretty good uh, the session and all uh, was pretty good every uh, um, rep felt the way it should have, uh, have felt um, as working sets I had three reps of 145 kilogram 
um, followed by three reps of 167.5 and in the top set I had 190 kilograms um, if you do not use the metric system like you should America uh, the numbers in pounds are all so blended in in the subtitles so you do not have to use your calculator um, I probably aim for an opener of 210 kilograms uh, and increase it by 10 kg with every attempt so this will put me on uh, at 230 kilograms uh, uh, on the final attempt which would be a 10 kilogram PR for me um, yeah on the top the top set felt pretty decent um, it felt hev heavy but not too heavy um, I got my three reps in I think I have t I had up to five or six reps left in the tank so I think uh, my goals are pretty realistic here followed by the actual lifting as uh, so of the actual working sets I prefer to do uh, conventional deadlifts as a variation of the main lift to assist my my usual lift um, I like conventional deadlifts more than like Romanian or stiff leg deadlift or even deficit deadlifts because let's face it face it if you're 193 and you are a deficit so there's no need to yeah, start even higher um, also in my opinion it won't harm you if you use the advantage, advantages of both styles of deadlifting um, I totally misgrooved the first rep but um, I, on the other sets it was way better um yeah already so all of all my sessions are done for before the meet I did like on Sunday I had bench on Monday I had deaths which I'm gonna show you in the video and on to do this this day I had squats so I'm gonna show the, that in another video um, but I figure my home gym is shit for recording on squats so uh, I have to, to think of something there uh, but I'm happy how, how this this taper work week actually worked and uh, it felt super good it's the first time I, I compete in the 93 kilo division and I feel be best prepared than ever the only thing I'm a little bit yeah uh, anxious about is my weight since um, yeah always around 93 kilograms this morning I was at 94 on other days I'm at 92 so I don't know if it's actually useful to to water cut or not I never did a, a water cut so I have to make some research on this uh, we we'll see how the meat were a total of 560 kilograms which would be a really 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 high PR for me uh, my openers will probably be at 
Uh, I think 180 on uh, 180 kilograms on squats, uh, about 115 kilograms on bench press, and um, about 210 kilograms on, on deadlifts, depending on how I feel on on Sunday, uh, on Saturday. So we'll see. Uh, if I get like 225 on the last deadlift attempt, 130 on the bench press, and uh, 200 would be something to dream about on the, on the squat. Uh, I'd be very, very happy about we see that on Saturday. I'll make an extra video for that. And um, yeah, you guys will see that then. So unlike deadlifting, I really, really love squatting. Um, it's mainly because my form re is really good and I'm com really strong compared to the other two lifts. Um, this taper actually, f the last two sessions felt perfect. Every rep was on point. Um, from the beginning to the end everything was smooth smooth as butter um, I couldn't have asked for, for, for better bench uh, squat sessions to be honest um, I started uh, with 77.5 kilograms for three just like in the deadlift I keep it uh, at low reps uh, for warm-up and increase the weight pretty fast um, second um, warm-up set was 97.5 kilograms, and third one and last one was was 117.5. Um, the actual working sets were also really good. I like to add the belt as last uh, as late as possible, like I I. I see no no purpose for, for a belt on squatting 127.5 kilograms or even on three plates. I don't need that there. I need the belt for on on squats to to have something to push my my abdominals against and something to to breathe against and uh, something to um, yeah have. To protect my my lower back, and this this is the, the case uh, when we talk about uh, 150, 160 kilograms. Um, I don't need that earlier. Um, but as you can see, <laughs> um, I wasn't lying about the light, lightning in my 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 usual gym um, because it's shit, um, and I really have to find something. I have to figure something out, but don't worry, I will. Um, so, the final set, just like on, on deadlifts on, on Saturday on, at the meet, I will try to increase uh, my attempts by 10 kg with each attempt. I'll start, I'll probably start at 180 kilograms and then go up to 190 and um, the last attempt will probably be 200 kilograms would be what would be a really really big thing for me since I've been chasing this for ages um, I'm glad I can can the uh, squat double body weight by now but I want more I want the those 200s would be a really really big, big uh, self-esteem boost for me um, yes and uh, we'll see how that will work unfortunately I don't have any footage on, on bench press since I started uh, video recording on, on Monday and bench press was Sunday so um, I provide that material next time um, so you can see my poverty bench press. It's Friday already and I just 
just had my final weight in. Um, my weight is at 93.3 kilograms. So I have like 300 kilograms more to go to hit my weight class. Uh, I think this will be rather easy since today is another rest day. Uh, I will drink a lot. I will not eat not at all because this will I think uh, harm my strength so I'm gonna keep my macros at about uh, 2000 calories again um, I will eat more protein than usual and as I react good to keto um, when I uh, want to lose weight fast I'm gonna eat like steak and eggs and steak and eggs and steak and eggs um, so I think it will be fine. I just uh, I don't have to. I, I won't do a water cut for uh, for that reason then, uh, because I already drink a lot. I drink like uh, eight till nine liters of water a day. So I'll just stop drinking water at six. Um, this should be fine for me. So um, I hope, hope sure hope you enjoyed this uh, little vlog vlogging ish uh, thing. Um, I sure did and uh, yeah, be pepper for more, uh, we at Stealth Powerlifting, we got way more to come. See you tomorrow at the meet.